Did you know that Tainter has been involved in many different YouTube controversies? Or that a lot of people actually suspect that he's a hacker or cheater in Roblox? Well, I bet you didn't. So I'm going to go through his entire story, including all the drama and the ups and downs of his career to truly see, how did we get here? Going back to the dinosaur ages of October 2014, when some random 15 year old kid created his account known as Tainter Plays. But he didn't start uploading until a year later in 2015, where he posted montages of Apocalypse Rising which he since removed from his channel. But hey, because he played Apocalypse Rising for almost two years now, he eventually decided that he'll switch to a new style of Let's Play videos with different games including Buddha Buddha, Mad City, Dungeon Quest, and more, where he found most of his success even getting hundreds of thousands of views on his update and playthrough videos, which is pretty good. Though it wasn't until he got into Roblox Arsenal that his channel really blew up. Something really exciting for him happened right here though, and that was getting his Roblox star code on May 21st of 2019. Right. Which if you don't know, just gives him some robots every time someone uses the code. Getting back to Arsenal, this is also when he first got involved in some drama with another YouTuber named Jimbo Slice. The situation was basically a misunderstanding between the two content creators because Tainter thought Jimbo was just using him for views since he made a few videos about him, even though he used Jimbo for content too, which doesn't make sense. Also right around this time, Tainter was invited to Darby Battle Season 2, which he ended up winning off. Obviously. And that's what sparked all the accusations of him cheating, even up till today, which I personally don't believe, like most people. That wasn't the end of his drama though, as we'll talk about his content and thumbnail stealing tendencies in just a moment. But for now, surprise! Tanker just hit 1 million subscribers before he switched to, of course, a game called Roblox Bed Wars, as many Arsenal YouTubers were doing because they ran out of content and got bored of the game. Bed Wars is a game where you spawn on a floating island and try to take your opponent's bed, which reminds me of another game now that I think about it. But anyways, in the game, he made challenge type videos like his most viewed one being I tried winning with every kit in Roblox Bed Wars, which has over 6 million views currently. And it was all going so well until he was exposed by YouTubers such as John Roblox and talked about by Sana Draw Stuff YT for copying several thumbnails almost exactly without any credit. I'll just let them explain it quickly. And here are some screenshots he posted of some Fortnite YouTubers videos, and then it shows Tinker's videos, and as you can see, they look pretty similar. Uh, he doesn't give credit, and I, and I don't think he actually likes to give credit, because he has done this before, uh, just not on a super obvious scale. Then later, Tainter made a response video to it, which just went like this, pretty much. Oh no, guys, I've stolen some video ideas. Not like everybody else on the platform does that or anything. Which concludes the entire history of Tainter, I guess. 